Each year, more than a dozen children in Canada lose limbs because they play in unsafe places. The War Amps of Canada has developed a play-safe program aimed at school-age kids. Young people who are amputees take the safety message into the classroom. Laura Prey now with the story of one of the War Amps safety ambassadors. 18-year-old Angela Myers is talking safety with this grade two class at Hugh Beaton School. Myers is one of the safety ambassadors the War Amps sends to schools across Canada to talk to kids about the dangers of playing in unsafe places. I want to tell children that it's very important to play safe. I don't want them to end up getting in accidents or end up losing an arm or a leg. Myers lost her right leg from complications at birth. She shows the kids her very first artificial leg, a wooden model she used at the age of one. She now has a computerized leg. My new computer leg is much better for me. It's much lighter. It's really comfortable and I can walk quite a bit. Part of her presentation is a video that shows the kids the dangers of playing near trains, electrical wires, farm machinery, and even the family lawnmower. The kids get the message. Something that, that's dangerous is playing near a icy road or near any cars. Playing by the train tracks and um, seeing a train and trying to run away from it. If you don't have a good memory, you could play on the stove and it's dangerous. You can, you can burn your arm. As well as taking the play safe message to school kids, Angela Myers draws on her own personal experiences to help other young amputees adjust to life with artificial limbs. Laura Prey, CBC News, Windsor. Okay.